Yesterday we talked about spring clean your beauty routine and today we're talking all about cleaning the house. It happens when the weather gets warm and everybody's like, okay, I want to be outside. I want to get rid of all this crap that's been in the house for a um, few months. Yeah. It's so nice, isn't it, Nicole? Yes, it is. Yes. Spring cleaning is just like a reset for the whole it new is. year uh -huh. and getting rid of all of the old stuffiness in the yeah. house over the, the holidays yeah yeah well and with lavender lush cleaning you i mean you guys don't use harsh chemicals mm -hmm. so which is super important i know that i'm stepping away from all those chemicals too but you know tell us about your product in your business right so we do use some products that can be a little bit more harsh in areas where you really need it like okay. the bathtub Smart. the oven um if we need to but we try to go as um, eco-friendly as possible and this cleaner is actually the one that we use the most. And we make that in-house. We mm -hmm. use just Castile soap, lavender essential oil, and water. And Amazing. we did that on a show before. So with all of the ingredients, you can make yourself. Isn't that cool? Like you think about when you read the ingredients that are on mm -hmm. something that we've all used for so many years. Right. Compared to how many ingredients are in, are in yours. And yet the cleaning power is so yeah. great. That's what I love. And that is so cool. So let's talk. Three tips for spring cleaning. My favorite one is declutter. You guys, I love throwing things away. Yes. I don't know why it gives me such great joy. It does. And I think just in general, our society, we like to collect things. We like to buy things. Totally. And it gets out of control sometimes. Mm -hmm. And so I love regular decluttering. Um, I like to do it per quarter when seasons change. But really Smart. donating things that you're not using, throwing away things, recycling things as much as you mm -hmm. can. Um, and it's really helpful if you get your kids, if you have children, get them into mm -hmm. the habit of doing that and not holding on to things for so long. And so it's helpful to have them because they tend to hold on to a lot of stuff. But absolutely. when they can get rid of some and if they can make some money selling it too, that's a, that's so a bonus. Smart. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Well, and I actually keep a bag in my closet mm -hmm. and I will put stuff that I'm donating in one. And right. like if it's stuff that can go to a friend or a niece or nephew or something, I'll put that in another bag. Yes. And then when the time comes and it's full and I take it. So yeah. that's a great way to declutter. Mm -hmm. The second tip when it comes to you don't want to start cleaning the bottom first and then right. working your way to the top because then all the dust obviously falls to the floor, right? Yes. Second tip would be to clean from top to bottom. And we have a cleaning process for our cleaning company because if we just went in and just try to tackle everything at once, it would take too much time. We would get, we would probably miss things. True. So we do have a process, um, but really cleaning from top to bottom helps you to have more of a process. You, you're less overwhelmed. Okay. Um, you're not jumping around everywhere, but then also if you're dusting things, the dust will fall down mm -hmm. and then you can make sure to clean everything afterwards. Your process, like what do you usually go in and tackle first? So when we go in, we talked about this on one of the episodes, when we walk into a room, um, we turn around and look at the door and the door is 12 o'clock. So we clean from 12 o'clock, we go in a clockwise motion. Oh, we go 12 o'clock to one o'clock, top to bottom, two o'clock, top to bottom. And that just helps us to stay organized That's and smart. have a good process. I like that. Okay. So these are great tips. Mm -hmm. Last but not least, dust everything, which I am so bad about dusting yes. sometimes. Yeah. I am so bad. <laughs> it's hard to keep it up with all of you know, the, little, the little nooks and yeah. crannies. Um, mm -hmm. But there are things that when you're sitting and you stare at a spot and you're like, man, it's been a year since I've touched that area. But trying to find, for spring especially, yeah. you have you probably have the windows open. So mm -hmm. there's probably dust coming in from outdoors True. and things that your family might be allergic to. But dusting regularly will help, especially if you have pets. That helps a ton. Um, but dusting again from top to bottom and then making sure to just vacuum up that residue, making sure to clean out your vents. All of that mm -hmm. dust just accumulates and it can cause a lot of respiratory problems. So that's very helpful. Smart. Well, I love these tips. And I'm sure other people do as mm -hmm. well. If you don't want to do these and you want to just have the experts come in and do it, you see the information right there right. on screen. So I noticed we have a few smudges. Shoot, can we yes. can we make this beautiful? Yes. Nicole? I'm like, I, she comes in and I'm scratches. like, Nicole, will you help us clean? This I'm not a glass up. repair company, but <laughs> I can give some tips. So this Lush mm -hmm. Cleaner is actually amazing because it is gentle mm -hmm. and it cleans tons of surfaces, but it also is really good on glass. Okay. Um, and I brought a couple of things that people might normally have. Most people have paper towels. So mm -hmm. obviously you can clean with paper towels. Okay. Um, microfiber is what a lot of people might have also. And we yes. use this a lot yeah. um, when we do our cleans. It's not gonna be as absorbent right away as a paper towel, but also does a really good job. Love it. And then this third one is really cool. You can find this on Amazon. This mm -hmm. is specifically a glass cleaning cloth. Okay. You could clean just with water, um, but using a cleaning solution also would be really helpful and Easy, it does I love a it. really good job. Yeah. Beautiful. Nicole, you're the best. Thank, Thank you. you. Always fun having you in studio. Get your cleaning on everybody. All right. We'll see you next time. Thanks. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this content and you found it useful, please make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell so that you can get notifications whenever we release new videos.